Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Surviving Mars. I hope you're all well. Now, if you remember in the last episode, we did get another shuttle in. We are on 62 population. Sol 151. Yes, crazy. We started to get down a bit of green here, but we do have this beautiful thing coming in. We're just waiting on the concrete to go into here. We have prioritized it to get the hanging gardens. And to be honest, when the hanging gardens is in, because it drastically increases the comfort, I'm hoping it does pass to this one as well, we're probably going to be able to bin off a few of these unwanted ones, you know? And we could just get a pure housing dome over here eventually. That's what I want. And then Sectors maybe end. trains to this. Because like, to be honest, this one might need to be self-sufficient dome, if that makes sense. Because if you look here... It won't let me connect them up because of the hill, so I'm going to go ahead and just delete them out here, and I'll do its own power and oxygen grid, and worst case is we'll have a drone hub in the middle here that meets to this one and goes to over to here. Uh, polymers are low at the moment. We have been bringing on the meteor storms wherever we can as well. There we go. We're currently in a meteor storm, and we've got another one in three days as well. It looks like it's down here to start with, which is good. Hopefully, we can get some polymers again from it that's what we've been doing and i'm going to keep deep scanning but other than that we're, we're doing all right i think we're in a, we're uh, finally in a good spot i've said this a few times but i genuinely think now we are i'm hoping this drops polymers and it looks like it is dropping polymers which is great and yeah big 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 focus is still going to be getting all of these engineers up inside of these as well to keep this production going polymer uh what is needed in these is it also engineers so having a drone hub over here, still going to require power, that's okay. What we can do is put that one down, pause that one a second. I'm going to start a little bit over here as well. So we've got our drone hub in. It's a prefab, so it'll go in anyway, but we're going to need the connection. So we're going to hit up the power cables from this. That might not be the smartest, I don't know. We can pipe this all the way in actually, so I'm going to bring this all the way up. Pretty sure the drones can go quite far with this one anyway. There we go. We'll do that. We'll get as far as we can with it. We can just use our friend over here for worst case scenario as well and bring that over. But this does have loads of drones anyway. This, I think the whole cable is covered anyway. All right, we have 15 seniors at the moment. How are we doing here? Vacant work slots two, vacant work slots Resources two. Are low. Okay, how is everything else in here? 3.9, 6.3. You guys still training? You are. New anomaly? Very nice. Right, this is what we need to get our research on. It's kind of important that we just slam through all these. He might get hit over here, but he's just casually going about his day in the middle of the meteors. It's fine. 1,500 on the research for that anomaly. That is huge. How are we doing here? We've only got three in there. Rare metals are a bit of a problem here, and we've got no one working in this one either. Um, I'm going to go ahead and bin off this rare metal extractor because we have just a major senior problem over here. And I'm going to move it over to this one. I think we can make do for the time being. We've got a little bit of cash. I'm just going to send that one off whilst it's there. And we're going to bring in this stem reconstruction look. So we're 48% of this one. So re that re increases the retirement age and death um, from old age happens later in a colonist lifespan. So they do live a little bit longer. Um, the retirement thing is what we want. We should move to this um, Hawkins Institute when we can as well. So I will get that one in. We're not doing that one just yet, but all the others are pretty good, I think. Don't need that one just yet either. I'm just going through because if there is anything good that we can get, then we should, right? Uh, moisture vaporators, finally. That might... 20k for a moisture vaporator. Are you serious? I think we'll queue that one up as well then. We've got... We're, we're pretty much done on all the low ones apart from over here, right? So we'll do that. And there we go. Rare metal extractor being built right there. So we're going to turn that one down to... One, two. So we'll have spares for anyone that wants to go in there as well. I might reduce this down, actually. We only have two in the uni. So we've got four vacant work slots there. I think we can reduce the machine parts here. New tech, to though. Compact hangers and growth back. stimulators. What is a growth stimulator? Vegetation grows 50% faster. I actually like the sound of that one. The other one we got. The maximum number of shuttles that a shuttle can house is increased by six. That is huge as well. Not something we can do right now, though. I just need this rare metals to continue. So one worker in there. Awesome. Uh, I might trade this out and get the... Uh, we've got two in there as well. That's fine. Research hey, complete. stem reconstruction is done as well. And we found a new anomaly. Lovely stuff. So a deep scan over here actually worked for once, which is nice. And we got our new research, didn't we? So 
even better, let's go into what we are on next. I do want to bring this tree down a little bit as well. So we got... How's this one doing? We're increasing that. I really want to be able to make the, uh, the lake stuff. Look at this birth rate. Yes. Oh, the happiness in here. I think... Look, I think it's safe to say we're, we're around the corner, all right? If I can get this population up, I'm so excited. We can pump up these numbers, but look at this. We're looking good. I'm just looking for anything that's going to... What is it for the... How will we get the water in? I don't know whether we just need to increase these before we can do the next one. For this, we've got four researchers now, so I'm going to switch this one back to our... Uh, let's go... Geologists. So we'll start getting some of these in better. The more money we can make, the better, right? I want to buy in seeds. I want to keep this going as much as possible. Because if I can get a few of these in, I think that'll be awesome. Current progress is shocking. Um, the user's power. So we're going to need to go down, actually. I think with the amount of bursts that we're getting in, the nuclear reactor. Going down that route might not be a bad idea. I think, can we outsource? I think we can outsource. We've got no money, really. I don't want to do that just yet. Maybe when this is up more. I'm going to unlock that as well. Now, officially, this is the best thing you can get in this in for comfort, man. Look at this. It's so good. Don't even need you, your worry of shopping here. Check this out as well. Also boosting this one really well. So we're, the birth rates are flying in. We are pumping four people in this research now. I wouldn't mind getting this Hawkins Research Institute on the go. And to be honest, all of these are good. I can work focus on this and obviously the polymers, which is still struggling a little bit, but that's okay. So we no longer have housing space in this one anymore, which is fine. I do think we could potentially look at getting a housing dome in. Now, do we do that over here and set up a train station? I'm not sure yet. I don't think we're at that point yet. I do think just having a microdome attached to this or to this actually over here. Did I fit one in there? I'm thinking pure housing, you know, and that, that spire and services will help anyway. That is highly unfortunate. I reckon that could fit if I flatten that. Let's literally just do that and see if this works. And then I'll get a... Just pause it a second. I'm just going to get a, a, a dumping site over here for it. I know it's in between, but that's fine. All right. Our supportive community is about to finish as well. I'm very, very Sector excited about this. Look at all these children being complete. born as well. I was just looking. I've cleared this out. And unfortunately, we can't quite fit a school in here. Now we can if we... I think we can do this. If I bin off this, I know I've moved stuff around a lot, right? But I want to get the school. I don't think the school fits, though, actually. It's frustrating. Can we get... Let's have a look. Research lab. Oh, it does all fit here. So if we go... Uh, we're going to have to move it across again. Damn it. I can't make my mind up. Well, I think I have made my mind up now. And we're going to need the research lab over here. Like that. And then we're going to have to bin this one off. Which is a little bit frustrating. But once this is built, we'll do it. It uses up some electronics. Nursery doesn't cost us anything anyway. It's just a bit of concrete. And uh, that can stay. It kind of makes sense to have it all here. And then I want to get the school in here. This is going to be like an education slash thingy dome and to be honest the way i'm looking at it is if we get the dome over here we can potentially look to bring the polymers this way and just have this as like a power hub right get rid of these and kind of move away from it and then move down here as our second one that's what i'm thinking so we won't need these domes you know how are you doing you've got eight rare metals we'll wait for those other two to get in there this is working really really well now 5.5 .5 in there so we, we will be getting and obviously the Automatic metal extractor is in for 9.6 with just the fuel thing. I haven't even amplified it, and I think that'll be more than enough now. So I'm feeling very, very confident on all this stuff now, and we should have some good money rolling in. And once the once we get a couple more graduates and growth, I'm going to bring in... I think I might have to up, up this shift here. This has been done now, so I can bin that one off once more. And the research, I just want to mirror this. I'm going to go one one and i'm gonna bin this one needs to be a high priority and i'm gonna bin that one out and we'll set that one to be enforced specialists here only specialists accepted there we go so we we flip that one over nicely and what we can do then is get our school in uh let's go that way and what does that cost electronics we've taken a bit of a hit on our electronics there but that should be fine i'm looking at the engineers here that should be okay and look at this 6.8 they are going in so what I might do is actually 
change this now to be restricted. And same goes for some of these. So we can actually up our... We could change this to non. Uh, no, we can leave that one open, actually. And if anyone gets the research trait, it does get filled. But I want the training to happen inside of this, right? All right, let's send this one off. We're 12 in now. So it's a nice steady income we've got now. We'll bring in our next rocket as well. I'm going to keep bringing seeds down with me every time. I might even get a second one of these in. But once our population's up, we did hit our research, didn't we? Interplanetary projects. What is that one? This is going to help us unlock the import greenhouse gases, which is the atmosphere, and capture ice asteroids. So this one is going to be our one. Uh, with that coming in, I think I'm going to outsource... Uh, let's not do that. We've got our research Sector thing going, scan. haven't we? We can get our Hawkins Institute as well. We'll be laughing. But here we go. we got the school coming, so this will help with our kids here. And let's get some better traits going. So, nerd, the happiness, composed, all sanity, halved. So we probably want performance boost when at high morale. What is the survivor trait? Lose left health. What? No, we don't need that one. Uh, gain a temporary morale boost every time a new technology. So we're going to go nerd, enthusiast, and then religious. And we're just going to turn off that one. We're just going to have kids in there for now. We've only got three at the moment, but I think that's a good idea. Get some good traits on some of these. Production is fantastic. So grudge. What is this? Oh, no. Discover the culprit. Right. Something is wrong. All data transfers from Earth have ceased after an explos explosion rocked our colony. Several colonists have been killed. Are you being serious? No. No. That best not be my colonists. Oh, no. Right, we're on 64. Uh, kill the elderly. That'll be fine. Our experts have begun fixing the data block as we speak. However, a preliminary analysis of our problem suggests it's sabotage from our rival. Okay, it will cost us further research to name the culprit. No outsource or sponsor research for 15 souls, but discover the culprit. Has died. Dead colonists. I think it was three seniors, you know. All right, vacant works lots is five over here, though. That's annoying. And this has been flattened out now, so we should be able to fit a microdome in here if we wanted to. I'm not going to do that just yet, actually, because with these two in here, we should be fine. We'll change it up a little bit. It looks kind of nice. Is there? Can we change the university? No. Only some buildings we can change by the looks of it. Hey, some anomalies. Beautiful. We got two. Amazing. So we're going to grab both of those then. That's going to help massively. And I'm going to get this guy. Well, let's find some polymers around the map here. There should be some. Treat colonists to remove flaws. Behavioral shaping. That's actually really good. Uh, we can't afford to get it in right now. But yeah, very, very cool. Uh, what have we got here? Proof service comfort and provides relaxation, allowing colonists to visit and gain comfort. Rejuvenation treatment. Oh, infirmary and medical center. Through discovered. Ancient terraforming device. Just two breakfalls. Instantly gain 20% in all terraforming. Holy crap. Oh my god. Did, look at that. Is such a thing even possible? Yes. Well. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so I think we need to call in another rocket here. I'm going to grab in 10 more seeds. And... I'm actually going to get in one more vegetation thingy here. So transformation is going nicely. Oh, various lake sizes showing on here now. I like it. But yeah, we're going to get a forestation. I think we'll put it over here. Feeling good about this spot. We've got happy oldie village over here. Bless them with a solar panel in the middle. <laughs> no one goes in the gym over here. It's quite funny. They're relatively happy, though, bless them. If we can get the breakthrough and never get old, then we'll be laughing. All right, let's bring in our new seeds. we got our second one going here that is now spreading as well. Look at this, almost 20% here. But we're going to be able to plant trees real soon because of this research, right? And he's ready to go with 16 metals already. Let's bring that one in and let's bring another one down. So, I kind of want to see what applicants we've got. I know that we don't need it anyway, uh, so I'm not going not gonna to be too fussed. I'm going to grab 10 more again. Now, we won't mess with more applicants. We'll just let... It kind of tick over and do its thing. We are now stabilized. Finally in a fantastic spot. Uh, it probably is time for a new dome. I wouldn't mind. We've got places spare. We do is upping this again. Let's get our electronics up. I'm going to start pumping that. I'm intrigued as to what they'll put in first here. I think they want more of those. I think four in there is okay actually to keep our money going. 
There we go, we're on 745 million and we can bring our next rocket in. It's kind of never ending now, we should be able to keep pumping that out. I'm just keeping an eye on fuel on that, we're, we're perfectly fine. Um, okay. Look at all these drones just hopping about, it's so cool, man. So happy with it now. And we got another anomaly, that is great. So let's get him over there. And to be honest, it's kind of making the drone hub requirement a little less needed you know we can just keep the commanders here i'm just gonna pop out a couple i know the drone load will be really heavy but that's fine just so we can get this finished here and oh, we lost a little drone over here but that's fine you'll be okay and there we have it it is in so we need to try and pipe this up but we'll just do this with one tunnel here so it'll just be just one passage from here to here beautiful and what we'll do is get in both a school. So we'll need... Well, first off, we'll need a... Do housing, so we'll need a nursery. One. Two. We'll get two nurseries in. One school. And one playground in the middle. And food services are still in this one, so and the, the happiness. So it should be okay, because the birth rate's getting out of control here, and then that does mean we can bin out all these. Look at this. Pretty nuts, man. Well, accepting a new food trade as well is making life a lot easier. We're so close to having 20% on all these. The temperature will be near 40% because of this research, if I've got that done right. I don't know if we need to build anything, but it's pretty nuts. And age group will be child and nothing else. Buy that one. And that should force the children across to this one pretty quickly. So we'll see though. Might need to see if we can attach this one as well. Anomaly analyzed. Oh, new text. Martian born strength and project Mohol. What the hell are they? Oh god. Mohol mine. Extracts metal, rare metal, and waste rock without the need of a deposit while heating the surrounding area. Oh my word. Okay, 30,000. <laughs> Uh, what's the next one? Megadomes. Oh, baby. I think this one is a good one to actually queue up soon. Well, now that I think about it, let's take the child off that one for now. That should get them moved over because it's unticked. There we go. Residents are in. So we just need the school and stuff to be done. And uh, we'll salvage that. Salvage that. Uh, salvage that. Like a conveyor belt? I don't want to... Yeah, I don't know. Research oh god, complete. look at this! Now, I'm not sure what happens or what. There's no greenness here. Liquid water on the surface of Mars. Where? Where's our water? I'm not seeing it. This is huge, though. <laughs> uh, or is it because... Yeah, because we've done that. So we could actually switch these. Look at this! Grass. Yes. We're going to put some grass in. We haven't got trees yet, so. This is huge, though. Look at that. Now, I do think our solar panels are going to get affected by this. We need to be careful. They're not going to be as effective as we do this. Yeah, atmospheric effect, minus 10%. That's okay. We can obviously work towards our other one. Does that mean we have... A blue sky not quite but the color is changing is it i don't know we'll see very very cool funding received another 240 million there we're almost back on a billion here and we're going to keep the seeds coming let's grab 10 more in and we got all this space now because of these guys living in here and we'll just cram in those guys over there so hawkins institute we can save that slot for but we do have some spots here it looks like we are now actually doing our farming over here because we have people to do it so let's see what we can fit in now and we go further down the production route here i think we personally keep it nice and clear ready you know and we have it though i think this section is fully blown and good to go now i forgot about changing these actually i like the uh the look of that one not a big fan of that i do like that one though are we looking over here golden oldies or are we are all all right yeah, we're fine. It's all the golden oldies just hanging on for dear life. Just thinking, actually, we could make ourselves a nice lake in here. It'd be pretty pretty cool, wouldn't it? 
I do want to plant trees around here, though. If we can get a vista spawn in here and uh, research, that'd be so cool. Bring in the rocket, though, with our extra seeds still going. And we are planting our first bit of grass. Can you see this? We have grass on Mars. Oh, it's beautiful. Now, guys, that is the perfect place to end this one out. So, as always, smash that thumbs up for me if you are new around here. Please do consider subbing to the channel. We're, we're well and well and truly established now, I think. And we are going into the late game and doing everything which is awesome. But yeah, take it easy. I'll catch you in the next one.